Hello everyone, welcome back to Pavli. The title of our today's video is How to notify team on Google Chat for new Instagram leads. So I'm running a business and to promote my business, I'm using Instagram lead ads. And I wish that as soon as a new lead is generated in my Instagram lead ads, automatically a notification should be sent to my team on Google Chat to notify them that we have received a new lead. For this, we are going to create a connection between Instagram lead ads and Google Chat. To create this connection without knowing any programming or coding language, we are going to use Pabli Connect. It is an amazing automation software. So in Pabli, we have the concept of trigger and action. For trigger, we are going to use Instagram lead ads and for action, we are using Google Chat. So if you also wish to learn this process step by step, follow me through the screen. Welcome to my screen. So as you know, in this video, we are going to learn how to notify team on Google Chat for new Instagram leads. To do this, I have already opened my Instagram account and I've also connected my Instagram account with my Facebook page, which is Peak Performance Physio. And over here, you can see the successful connection. And now using this Facebook page, I'm running Instagram ads to generate more leads on my business. And over here, you can see that I've also selected the same Facebook page, Peak Performance Physio in my Instagram ads campaign. And also I've created some legion forms using this Facebook page only. And now I wish that as soon as someone sees my Instagram ad on their Instagram account, they should also get the option to fill in the legion form. And as soon as they fill in the legion form, I want to notify my team on Google chat that we have received a new lead with the details of the lead. For this, we are going to create a connection between Instagram lead ads and our Google chat. To create this connection, I have already opened the landing page of Pabli simply by searching pabli.com slash connect in my browser. It is very easy. So as soon as we we'll open the landing page of Pabli, we are going to get two options. One is sign in and the another one is sign up for free. So if you are a new user, you can click on sign up for free and you are going to get 100 of tasks free every month. But I'm an existing user, so I'm going to click on sign in. And now it is opening all Pabli apps. Over here, you can see all the tools and applications offered by Pabli. But in today's video, we are going to use Pabli Connect because we are connecting different applications. So I'm going to click on access now. And now it is opening my dashboard. And to start with the automation, we are going to click on this button right over here, which says create workflow. And now it is asking me the workflow name and the folder I want to save the workflow in. So I want to save the workflow in this folder which is automations and I want to name my workflow as notify team on Google chat for Instagram leads and then we are going to click on create. And now it is opening the most important window of our automation that is our workflow window. This is the most important window because we have trigger in action in this. Trigger means when this happens and action means do this. By this, you can understand that the trigger is the commander for the workflow and actions follow the commands. And as you know that we can have only a single commander but multiple followers. So over here, we can have only a single trigger but multiple actions following the commands of our trigger. So now we are going to select our trigger application, which is Instagram lead ads because I want that as soon as a new lead is submitted in my Instagram lead ads, automatically my workflow should be triggered. So I'm going to search for Instagram lead ads and select it. And now for the trigger event, we are going to select new lead instant. And then we are going to click on connect. And as you can see that it is asking me to add a new connection or select the existing connection. So if you have already connected your Instagram lead ads account with your Pabli's workflow, you can click on select existing connection and then save. But if you haven't, you have to follow me, click on add a new connection and then connect with Instagram lead ads. And now it is asking me to select my Facebook page. It is asking me to select my Facebook page because the connection between Pabli Connect and Instagram lead ads happened through this Facebook page only, which we have already connected with our Instagram lead ads, which is Peak Performance Visio. So that's why it is asking me to select my Facebook page and my Facebook account. So I'm going to select it and click on continue. And yes, you can see that as soon as I click on continue, we have successfully connected our Instagram lead ads account with our Pabli's workflow. And now it is asking me for the page and the legion form. So again, we are going to select the same page, which is Peak Performance Physio. So I'm going to search for it and select it. And then for the legion form, I'm going to select Instagram lead ads because I want that only the leads of this particular form should be captured by my workflow. If you wish to create this automation for all your legion forms, you can select all legion forms or any another desired form. So after selecting my desired form, we are going to click on save and send test request. 
and now it is saying waiting for a webhook response and in the notes it is saying do a test submission slash record so we have to do a test submission in order to capture the webhook response so as you know that my campaign is not a live campaign over here you can see in draft so that's why i'm not going to receive the latest leads if you are running a live campaign you are going to receive the latest leads right over here so you can either wait for the leads or if you don't wish to wait then you can open a new tab and search for meta for developers we are going to search for meta for developers because we are going to generate a test lead so we are going to open meta for developers and then we are going to go on more and then tools and then we are going to scroll and select lead ads r2 debug tool and now it is opening my lead ads testing tool from here we are going to do a test submission so for the page we are going to select peak performance physio so i'm going to select it right over here and then for the form we are going to select instagram lead ads and then we are going to click on preview form and now it is asking me to fill in the details so we are going to fill in the dummy details first name as demo last name as user email as demo@pablitudes.com phone number as this and the company name as pabli after filling in all the details i am going to click on continue and then submit and yes you can see that it is saying your test lead has been sent this means that lead ad testing tool has sent the details of our lead to our workflow so i'm going to open my workflow and check that if pabli has captured the response of our lead or not and yes you can see that pabli has captured the response here is the first name the last name the email and the same phone number with the company name so this means that my trigger step is successful and now we are moving on to our action step for our action application we are going to select google chat because i want that as soon as a new instagram lead ad is submitted automatically a notification should be sent to my team on google chat so i'm going to search for google chat and select google chat hangout and then for the action event we are going to select create message and again we are going to click on this connect button and now you can see that it is asking me for the chat webhook url so to get this url we are going to open our google chat and over here you can see that i've created a space for instagram lead ads so i'm going to click on this drop down menu right over here and from here we are going to go on apps and integrations and now you can see webhooks so we are going to click on add webhooks right over here and now it is asking me the webhook name so i'm going to name my webhook as new instagram lead and then for the avatar i'm going to paste the bot icon i wish to add if you don't wish to add any bot icon you can leave this field as blank too and then we are going to click on save and yes you can see that we have created a new bot and over here is the webhook url so we are going to copy this link and then we are going to paste this in our workflow and now after pasting this it is asking me for the message so i want the message to be hello team we have received a new lead from instagram lead ads the name email phone number and the company name make sure that we don't miss this lead and we connect with this lead as soon as possible so over here you can see that i have left name email phone number and company blank because i am going to map this so mapping is a method by pabli which means inserting the data from the previous step and as you know our previous step was the trigger step where we selected instagram lead ads as our trigger application so we are going to map the details from the response of our trigger application only and over here as soon as i'm going to map the details automatically my details will turn dynamic and change with every new lead form submitted and also my My workflow would be ready to run in real time too because of this mapping. So now we are going to map the name. So I'm going to open the response and search for name right over here. And over here you can see the first name and the last name. So first we are going to map the first name of our lead and then put a space and then we are going to map the last name. We are going to do same for the email. We are going to search for email right over here and map the email of our lead. Same for the phone number. We are going to search for phone number right over here and map the phone number. Again same for the company name we are going to search for company and map the company name and now after mapping all this and pasting the chat webhook url we are going to click on save and send us request and yes you can see that we have received a positive response that we have successfully sent a message on our chat so we are going to open our google chat and check that if we have received the message or not and yes you can see that we have received a new message hello team we have received a new lead from instagram lead ads over here is the first name 
the email, the phone number and the company name that we entered. So this means that my workflow is successful and I'll just test the workflow once and this time I'm going to give you a real time example. So to do this, I'm going to open my lead ads testing tool and we are going to generate a new lead. So to do this, I'm going to first delete the previous lead because we can only create a single lead in our lead ads testing tool. And after deleting the previous lead, we are going to refresh this page so that we can again preview the form. And again, we are going to select the page as peak performance physio. And then for the form, again, we are going to select Instagram lead ads. And again, we are going to click on preview form. And we are going to fill in the details once again. For the first name, I'm going to keep it as test. Last name as user. Email as test at the rate pablitudes.com. The phone number as this. And then for the company name, we are going to use Pabli Connect this time. And then we are going to click on continue and then submit. And yes, you can see your test lead has been sent. Again, this means that lead ads testing tool has sent the details of our lead to our workflow. Pabli captured the response, triggered the workflow and further sent a message to our Google chat. So I'm going to open my Google chat and check that if we have received the message or not. This time we are not going back to our workflow and clicking on save and send test request. We'll directly open our Google chat and yes, you can see a new message with the new name, new email and the new phone number with the new company name has been sent to this space automatically. So this means that my workflow is successful and I'll just summarize the workflow for you once. For our trigger application, we selected Instagram lead ads and then for the trigger event, we selected new lead instant. For our action application, we selected Google chat hangout and then for the action event, we selected create message. We did this because we wanted that as soon as a new Instagram lead ad is submitted, automatically a message should be sent to my Google chat, notifying my team that we have received a new Instagram lead ad. So we were successful with our workflow. Over here, you can see the two messages we sent during this video. So if you have any questions related to the video or the workflow, you can directly comment on this video. And for your reference, I'll just clone the workflow and share the workflow link in the description box. Thank you for watching. Not only these applications, but with the help of Pabli, you can integrate many more applications. So now, if you have any doubts, you can reach us at support at the readpabli.com. If you have any queries, you can reach us at forum.pabli.com. And if you have any pricing related issues, you can follow this website. And if you find our videos helpful, do like and subscribe our channel. Thank you for watching.